Firstly, open InShot. Go to Video. And today we're going to open a new video. And I'm choosing this one here because I know this one doesn't have any sound behind it. The first way to insert music is from your local library. And here's how you find it. So click on Music. Select Music for now. So click on Local. And you can see I've got a whole bunch of different songs in here. Now, where have they come from? Quite a while ago, I uploaded a whole bunch of songs to my iPhone using the iTunes program on my computer. So by going to Apple Music and choosing Songs, I get the exact same list of songs over here. So I've got access to Motorhead, Iron Maiden, even the Beatles. However, the problem with using music from your iTunes is most songs will be picked up for a copyright claim because those songs are already on other YouTube channels. Now there's a curious point. Will I get a copyright claim just for the few seconds that I've played of these ones so far? So make sure you check out the YouTube version and I'll pin the comment at the top to say if it's been copyright claimed or not for just those few second little snippets. Let's find out. Anyway. Only worry about copyright if you're uploading it straight to YouTube or a similar social media website. If this is for your work or for a school project or something similar, then you can use any song you want. So I'm going to choose The Beatles and I can click Use. And here it is, straight above my timeline here. You can see that purple line. And can we hear it playing? Yes, we can. And it's much louder than the sound of my voice. If you want to change that, click on the purple video and choose volume up here. You can make it much quieter or also much louder if you wanted to. And press the tick once you are satisfied. If you want the song to start later, so maybe you want the song to start right about here. Once it's highlighted white, press the split button. And then that splits the song into the part before this white line and the part after. I want to delete this part before, so I've highlighted it, I press delete, and now it's gone. If you want that song to start from the very beginning of the video at this point, just click and drag it all the way back to the start, and there you go. Now it begins from here. The second way is to extract audio from a video in your camera roll. 